He wants us to have self-control. He wants us to have control over the world. So someone who is safe is a person I can look at, see him, see him face, and say, I will not do it because this doesn't please my father. Christianity is a personal journey giving you so much that you to insult. If you someone who has quick temper, you just become totally different. But your personality will not change. So your journey with Christ is different. It is custom and curved just for you. The way Christ will handle you, the way Christ will deal with you, it's going to be different. Be yourself. Be yourself in the presence of God. Everything you do as a lady, it should be in the will of God. Hey, my lady, how are you doing? Hope you're doing great. So this thing is on my mind, and I want to give it a short here. Uh, there is this thing that people just think like being Christian, it means like you stop doing doing what you love. You change your personality, like you change yourself and who you are. That is absolutely not true. The reason here is that when you be, when God converts you, when you become a true believer, following Jesus, He just amplifies His mode of who you are. If you are kind of outgoing person, He will you start your outgoing gift for His kingdom. If you're someone who, who loves to look nice, love to wear nice things, He will just amplify that about you. So it also reflects in the same manner. If you are someone who don't like to to dress, who just is so focused on His work and everything about work work you will, you will have that same uh, attitude that same it's drive. like people are thinking like when christ converts you he takes away your personality from it you. is 100 percent true that god makes you of total different person in the light that he's like giving you so much that you to insult if you someone who has quick temper you just become totally different but your personality will not change. If you're someone who loves to be around people, who loves to go out, who loves friends, like you will be that kind of person who loves to talk about God everywhere. Finding Jesus is a personal work, work. The way God will deal with me, the way I will relate to God, the way I will I will worship God. I don't will not worship God like that because it's this personal. God business is something that's so personal. A person can be converted and they are true believer and they are pure Christian. And this person is still able to wear a racket trousers. If God converts a lady that will used to be a scraper in the street, in the street, you will not expect God to automatically, automatically make her walk with Him to become so in a way that no, God will be moderate with her because why He knows where she comes from. So instead of her wearing the clothes that is so short. She will wear clothes at the modest. And her dress code may not be like a custom Christian. Not because she's coming to Christ, he will begin to walk on her little by little. Like he himself will begin to teach her. But he will teach her his ways, in his own timing, until she becomes what he wants her to become. So it is very bad as a Christian, like Christian young ladies, to become to judge other ladies. So let's stop this whole judging people. I think, from my own opinion, that makes the difference in God or someone is... He wants us to have self-control. He wants us to have control over the world. So someone who is safe is a person I can look at, see him, see him face, and say, I will not do it because this doesn't please my father. That is a believer. That is a, someone who knows who he is and just be conscious about how you live. I think uh, in some, that's what I was So I just thought to share this because the Holy Spirit was telling me, like, the way that I work with you is different. The way that I work with you is different. So I knew that. This is something that maybe someone else will be struggling with because he kept on telling me the way that I work with you is different from how I work with other people. And it's me, it's personal. He is my God. My God. I love God, though. God, I love you. I, you are sweet, though, Jesus. You are sweet. Yeah, Jesus is sweet like honey, though. Know? Sweet like honey, okay? Jesus sweet like honey. Hey, Jesus, I'm sweet past me. Jesus, give like me sweet. Hey, thank you for your love. Hi, Jesus, love. A nice soul is sweet too. So, so, in my next episode, okay? Be subscribed to this channel if you're not subscribed. And love you for love of God. Send you kisses and hugs. Bye.